Hey, what's up, guys? I want to answer a question that uh, I don't know if a lot of other people are wondering out there as well, but I know this is a question I often thought about. So, if you're my, if you play Minecraft uh, and you're going out to buy a new computer or a laptop, and then your your goal is to strictly, mostly play Minecraft, I want to show you what kind of what components are important for you to get the best performance and frame rate. For this game so if we open up task manager here and then go into minecraft if i go under performance so this is my cpu my memory i put i put in about six gigs because i have 16 and then uh this is my uh gpu here i, I have a gtx 1660 so as you can see while i'm running minecraft as you can see my cpu is being heavily dependent like way more dependent than my GPU is because Minecraft just runs so like mostly on your CPU like it's mo it's more CPU dependent than GPU is not to say that uh, the GPU is not important so for instance if you want to end up using shaders as you can see if I'm just going to go into shaders here I'll enable that if you want to use shaders or a very high texture pack then that's when you want to have a good GPU. As you can see, my GPU just went up to from about 30 something percent to 60 something percent usage because of this is partly because of the like the lighting as well. The lighting has to do a lot. So if you have a good GPU, uh, if you want to play just Minecraft, would like without shaders or a high texture pack, then I would f focus on buying. Um, a good Intel i5. You don't you don't need a high tense uh, high uh, processor either because uh, Minecraft's not really that heavily dependent on like a very good processing unit. You can probably buy about probably a i5 9th gen i5 would be do you, do you good. That's the one I have. Or even an 8th gen i5 would be more than enough to handle Minecraft. And make sure you get, uh, and RAM is also very important. So if you you want to have at least eight gigs of RAM. For pretty much any game out there, like mostly good graphics games require about eight gigs of RAM, so eight to sixteen gigs is plenty. And then uh, for your graphics card, you can you don't need to go all out and buy like a RTX twenty sixty just to play Minecraft. Like I even even if you want to use shaders, like my components, I'm using a GTX uh, sixteen sixty, and I'm getting about. 100 like 150 frames you know i'm put like it's it's running well and if i just go uh, turn off shaders i'll get a probably about four or five hundred so you can probably g be fine with like a gtx 1040 uh low end 1040 or if you want to get a bit of a better one then maybe get like a 1050 ti with uh, four gigs of uh vram that can handle a lot more other things but uh this is strictly for minecraft if you want to play something like COD or a different type of game that's GPU dependent then I would I would try to go for a 1080 or like a 1080 Ti or even a 1660 this is the one I have because that those games are mostly GPU dependent rather than CPU so you can still run with the i5 uh, even for those games but you want to make sure you have a good GPU to be able to run it but if you want to strictly just play Minecraft with just general settings without shaders or anything you don't need to break the budget for a really really good uh, graphics card you could just get like a decent um, pretty good uh, processor and you can just get like an okay graphics card and you should be able to run Minecraft pretty well as you can see I'm running about 600 frames and if I'm like really playing on a server or something I'll, I'll push over to 300 so uh, I hope that answered your uh, question and if it did please leave a like